Although there are no furloughs, layoffs, or cutbacks just yet, it appears the governor is throwing the ball back to the legislature to approve Section 30-backed revenue bonds for the third time. While lawmakers are actively discussing the district court's contempt charges, Acting Speaker Tina Munya Barnes says taking any money out of the government will only hurt the people. I'm telling you right now that before we take the money that the government is supposed to run the government with, we will impede on the livelihoods of our community as a whole. Barnes and Senator Frank Uggen Jr. both agree everyone needs to be on the same page. That's why the senator feels the legislature, the attorney general, and the governor need to meet to discuss the true extent of the district court's ability to take money from GovGuam. Uggen adds that the government cannot afford the million dollar a week payments. We need to decide as a government and as a community whether in fact the federal courts in this case can continue to impose its, its authority over the local government. I think that, and that's a question that has to be answered by either the higher courts or has to be answered uh, by all the parties involved. And Only when everyone meets is Uggen willing is, to endorse a challenge to the court's authority. In the meantime, he says an emergency session is up to the governor, but he still believes Camacho should aggressively pursue a public-private partnership to build a new landfill. I think that the governor of Guam uh, in this case, as well as the legislature, we've got to get together and find out exactly where the three or four million dollars was extracted from, how that's going to impact the government uh, operations in the foreseeable next two or three weeks, and then where do we go here or not? While no emergency session has been called yet, the acting speaker also agrees the governor should still look at the bond options and viable financing alternatives the legislature has already provided in Public Law 30-1. I'm concerned that, 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 that this administration has not moved forward in the authorizations that we have given them. And like I said, we need to all work together and that opportunity was given to them and we need to move forward.